Hey guys, this is Sissy Knitting for my yarn addiction video. Oh, I come up the stairs so I'm a little out of breath. And I went on this haul at the end of March. This is my first big haul in a while. Yeah, well, big, big, big haul. So, I got a lot of cleaning up in here to do. So I figured maybe this weekend I'll get it tackled and stuff and if we get approved please keep us up, um, in your prayers we're hoping to get a house and this house would make it very easy for all of us um, there is still stairs but it's not as bad as here and there's a big den area in the bottom that we could cut into a second room if we needed three rooms later on I mean four rooms because it's three bedroom you know what I mean my mind ain't thinking so we will pray and see if it's meant to be God will will get the house if it's not then he has other plans so. but anyways keep us in your prayers about that because we just we really want to get out of here and have something of our own but I will still have my craft room and stuff so but here we go. Y'all not here to hear me rambling about my life. Y'all here to see yarn. Okay. Okay. I got this yarn to make me a hat. Because I've got a shawl in this cuzzle. Color. Um, it is called Razzle. Razzle. Yeah. Razzle. Berry. Yeah, Razzle Berry. And I love this can't wait to make me a slouchy to match my little um, shawl. So, I'm going to lay that right there. And, let's see. I can't get these to lay. I want, I got two of the, it's not coming out right. My lighting in here sucks. Somewhat right. It is called, and I got this on sale. It's 366 uh ocean spray and I thought this would make a cute little wrap I got a lot of this stuff for my spring items that I want to make up and sell so hopefully I can get it all sorted and get it done the way I want to get it done and work through what I've got I am on a no yarn buying diet except the exceptions for yarn addiction starting May the 8th and Honey, if you look in here, you'd be like, girl, you don't need no damn, damn more yarn. Yeah, I said damn. Um, fantasy. This I love. I mean, it's got, it's got dark greens, it's got sage, it's got dark purples, it's got light purples. They kind of look like a very light purple. I wish you could really see the colors true, truly. If I can quit studying, I'll be fine. Oh, this is gorgeous. This is like a teal color. And it is called Peacock. I got two of these. And this is 400 and what? No, 355. 355 times 2. It'd give me enough to make a little shawl. Because I think I used 800 to make a big shawl. Yeah. So this would probably be another wrap. This really depends. And, hang on. I got these two colors. Oh, I love this. Okay, this is called Cloudy Sea. And now this, this will be a fight if I don't keep it. Because this got purples. Um, I want to say it's got a little bit of that peacock color. It's a little bit lighter than that. And gray. This is gorgeous. This, yeah, Cloudy Sea. Is that not beautiful? And I only got 252 a yard. You know the colors like this, you get less anyway. But that would be enough to make a, uh, what is it called? Jennifer makes all the time. Road trip scarf. Something short. Yeah. It is adorable. And, girl, that ain't it. Where is that? Yeah, that's it. I cannot walk by. This is really vibrant color, y'all. I mean, bright called mango it is woo, right mama 
you know, these two look kind of pretty together. But maybe I need to get in better lighting to find out. But I'm vibrant anyway, you know what I mean? But, um, it is the same thing, 355. Be cute as a wrap, something like that. And a lot of these I got for spring stuff, like I said. And I got two. Ooh, that hair on it. That better be hair and not no stain. Yeah. Little fuzz balls. Let's see. Tropical pink. And I like. Can't see if you can see that. You see that little purse? That is adorable. I might do that. That's a hexagon purse. That's cute. That's a good way to stash your, um, bust your stash. It's adorable. But this is, um, tropical pink. Very cute and pretty colors. And, yeah, I ain't done yet. <laughs> I got, should have got three of these. Because I didn't think. Um, 255 yards. So I can't do a shawl with this. Unless I go back and get another. Two's four, four, ten. It's five hundred yards. I would I would need one more skein. And this is a purple color. It's not blue like it's showing. And it's called Grapelet. So if I wanted any more, I'd have to go. If I wanted to do a shawl with this, I would have to go order me another skein. But. And it's not a custom order, so it's not like, oh, I gotta have this. No. But if I do start a project, and that's in the exceptions. If you start a project and you don't have that yarn in your stash, you may get that one skein. So. We'll see. Maybe I can come up with something different. I love making shawls, so they're addicting. I love Bob Wilson's shawl. Uh, what is this called? Ooh, Zachary. Turquoise. He's kicking me. I love this color. It's so soft. I got a Hobby Lobby now, and I tell you what. I, I mean, I love Red Heart. Don't get me wrong. And I love with love and all that. But I love this yarn. It's just like heaven to me. And this one is called... Come on. Ocean. And this is pretty. And I'm wondering. I'm going to look through my stash to see if I can use this in a blanket. That would be that would be pretty if you took. What was this? Turquoise? Yeah. If you took turquoise, ocean, and maybe like a light pink. Or, technically, if you take a peacock color and get all them together that would be a pretty blanket okay that is my yarn haul yes I went all out plus I go went and got Scarlet some um what is it called crafts to do for Easter I figured we'd do some this weekend get ready to that way she got some gifts to give out and <coughs> all I can do is call I'm sorry I tell you what that kickball killed me I didn't play kickball. I was just watching the babies and stuff. But it's so near a uh, what is it called? Um, baseball field, and you just inhale that dust. Ugh. But anyways, that's my yarn haul, and you can see I need help. But hey, at least it's nothing that's gonna physically harm me, and I enjoy what I do, and I am using my stash up and stuff. But I got a lot that. I need to go through and organize and just get everything ready. And I'm hoping to get pictures done soon for that challenge that starts in May. Before I have to box everything up in case we do move. Knock on wood. I'm hoping we get it. Because I have got some design things going on in my head for that den area. And there's a place you can put a TV downstairs. Oh, me, Scarlett, Randy, and Zach going to be having fun downstairs in my yarn room. This is Scarlett's, and it's got some 
stuck in its ear. I'm sorry. I'm rambling now. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this yarn addiction video. Please check out the people that do yarn addiction videos. If you'd like to join yarn addiction videos family, oh, let me know and I will add you to the link list. You do not have to do videos to be in the yarn addiction group on Facebook or Ravelry. This is something we just do for fun and we also share our projects sometimes. It just really depends on how your life's going. Because if you like me, you got a little one and life gets busy. But anyways, talk to you guys later. Have a wonderful Easter. Ugh, Easter, sorry. And um, God bless. Bye guys.